Hi guys, welcome to my Scottish Tooth video. This is Robin and Daryl. Hope everybody's having a good day. It's a pretty day here in Charleston, South Carolina. Grab yourself something refreshing to drink, sit back and relax, and let's look at some jewelry. We're going to start off, we're still working on Jewelry Jar 203, mm -hmm. and um, we're going to start off with some necklaces. Here's a little pearl necklace here, and a pink pearl necklace on this side. This one has a little extender with a pearl on the end. Here's your lobster claw clasp. Here are your pearls. This is a very sweet small necklace. And it is, let me see, 14 inches. We'll do that one for three. There you go, honey. Thank you. This one has a ribbon that needs washing. And uh, I consider this a uh, Hobby Lot item. I'm not going to do Hobby Lots for a while. I'm just going to price out Hobby Lot items. This is a dollar. Okay, oh, mister. I don't know. I'm waiting. Ah. Oh, there he goes again. Oh. <laughs> oh, I like that one. It's got all these little charms on it. All little doodads. Huh? Makes me sing. <laughs> Here we go. A multi-stranded necklace. With shell and bead and chain. And then this little charms. On this long necklace. This one's got a lobster claw clasp and it's very um, uh, worn. Rollo chain is worn, the beads are worn, the shell pieces are still good. It's got a brutalist look if you're looking for that. You can pass that as brutalist. Uh, we'll do that for a dollar. And the next is this little charm bracelet. You've got this porcelain bead here with the beautiful flowers on it. That's exquisite. This glass bead here in the purple. Faux pearl. Large rhinestone. A little crystal drop that may be acrylic but it's beautifully capped very ornate a little flower with the rhinestone in the center it's a copper colored chain with a lobster claw clasp very cute and we'll do this one for five dollars very cute. The next one, we have this beautiful doubled silver tone necklace with curved bar. And then this beautiful heart, cross, and peace sign necklace in silver tone. This is your bright silver tone necklace here. It's encrusted with little uh, rhinestones there. Lobster claw clasp. Here's the back. It's in brand new condition. We'll do this one for four. This one has a lobster claw clasp extender with a bead, gunmetal and color. All these little charms with crosses. Very ornate cross there. There's your puppy heart. Another peace sign. Another cross with the swirls. Scroll-like. Another peace sign. And then another heart. We'll do this one for five. Five. 
Next one's a beautiful Hishi bead. Nice large double lobster claw clasp. It's called canvas. You could actually add a pendant to that too, but you'd have to be able to get it over these humongous lobster claws or remove it. You can remove it at the jump ring and then put your bead on there. I wouldn't. I'd just wear it just like it is. Or either clasp something under this end. It's got a nice link to it. It is 20 inches. We'll do it for two dollars. This one has a lobster claw clasp extended with the bead. We have glass beads, wood beads, black beads with uh, gold specks on them. It's very cute. Triple stranded. I think, I'm not sure if these are acrylic or what. These definitely are glass, I think, in here. Yeah, yeah they feel cold. Uh, we'll do this necklace for Five dollars, and it is. Let me give you a link. Fully extended. On the shortest end, it's going to be 19 inches. Five dollars. And the next ones are graduated pearl again and wood on chain with gold tongue beads. Barrel clasp. Here are your pearls. They graduate in size. Here's the other side. We'll do these for three. And this necklace is give me a second. Eighteen inches, three dollars, and the next one is a chain double lobster claw clasp. Again, curved chain. Oops. Here we go. More wood. And double layered. We'll do this one for two. It's very pretty. This is uh, a lobster claw class extender with the bead. I need that one's too. Just hmm? hand me that. Oh, please. <laughs> this has got a wire with glass beads. No. Yes. Yes and no. I think some are and some are not. This one I believe is. And I am right. And this one I believe is not. And I am right. Okay. The clear ones are not. They're acrylic. These little square, squarish beads are glass. And the round bead I think are acrylic. No, those feel like glass too. Let me test, test these fasted ones. Okay, they're not. We'll do that necklace for two dollars. This one. You have glass and acrylic beads and a nice lobster claw glass and extender. Here's our next necklace. It's a beautifully beaded necklace that I think fits over the head because I don't see clasp. Very pretty. It is 22 and a half inches in length. Do that for three. 
We have this one that he couldn't seem to get untangled. No, I can tangle. In a hurry. <laughs> I said untangled. Oh. It's a 1928. It's multi-stranded. And let's see what's going on. Jeff, yeah. that's my oldest son, so we'll be right back. Hello. Okay, we're back, and that was a great call from my son. And granddaughter. And granddaughter, and they were picking up the other grandson. And here we go. This, we have this necklace on with the black and the curved bar. And this black necklace, three layers, little crystals. That I had tangled up severely. <laughs> yes. It's okay. We still love you. This is very pretty. Gunmetal in color. Lobster claw clasp. I have to recover from the phone call. I was zooming out, was zooming before then. That was so nice to hear from them. They all sounded very happy. And this necklace is 15 and a half inches. We're going to do this one for five. It's very beautiful. And then the next one is multi-stranded, 1928. Gunmetal in color. Beautiful fasted black crystals. Multi-chained. We'll do that one for five. And we have this we're going to do for free for anybody who wants it. I'm not sure. It's a wraparound scarf type, I guess. Denim and orange and red sunset colors. I'll get two of these things. And we have two of these. One with the yellow beads and one with the peach pearls. They are magnetic and I'm looking to make sure we don't have any earrings stuck to them. Sometimes that happens. I put them in bags separate so they shouldn't. Okay. What am I severely doing now? Oh well. We're going to do both of those for five. Alrighty. And we got this beautiful. Multi strand, a multi uh, strands, a rose, multi rows of black, two, three, four, five rows of black rhinestone. One is missing. I'm still selling it as is, and I'm going to sell it for $8. It's beautiful. We have a beautiful Dalmatian Jasper and gold chained bracelet. Very pretty. I like that. And it's got some extra room so it can fit a larger wrist. We'll do this one for six. Very pretty. We have this one. It's either glass or stone. I'm not sure. I think stone. Probably, um, it's got LH on there. This nice ball piece. Very ornate. So light, I think. We've got some room on it. Stretch is still good in that. We'll do that one for six. We have this pretty little stretch in the red goes right on. You could even put a charm in here if you wanted to. We'll do this one for three. We have a little peach and red and, and uh, orangey cha-cha type bracelet, little charm bracelet. Lobster claw class. Let me give you a link. Because this does not stretch. It is seven inches. We'll do that one for three. We 
we have this bracelet here. Now this has come out, and that's come out, so you might want to trim that. Still got it stretched, marbled, and then we have these that are just black. Some are smooth, some are fasted, different um, shapes. One, two, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We'll do these for three. This pretty cross bracelet here. It is magnetic. Beautiful tan. It's got some of the copper showing through on the underside. Pretty matted gold tone on that side. Pretty matted gold tone cross. We'll do that one for three. We have this one. Again, the same type. This is still in pretty good shape. This is your underside. Got like a animal skin um, design to it with the gold beads. We'll do that one for three. We have this, it's stretched out. I'm not sure what it is. We'll do that for a dollar. Oh, it's got hair. As I said, all hair is removed and things are cleaned up. But this is a hobby lot, but we still remove the hair off of that. Hobby lot items are not cleaned. Hobby lot items come as is, except for hair. If I see hair, the hair is coming off. What they probably used it for was a hair tie. And that's probably why it's got hair in it. That would be a good... Yeah, that's what's happened. So, there you go. This is beautiful. Mother of Pearl Bars. Does have some uh, thinning of the... the uh, rubber and you have this sticking out but still beautiful pieces we'll do that for three this is like you put on those swatches those swatch watches it's a band we'll do that for two here's a little heart toggle class cancer awareness hope courage and strength We'll do that as a freebie. We have these two little bracelets here. This pink one is glass. And these are metal. And I'm not sure if these are glass or not. I can't tell because of the metal. We'll do those two for $2. We have some graduating size. Pearl stretchy bracelet. It's in good shape. We'll do that for five. Here's a genuine leather wrap bracelet. Almost looks like it. You put something inside it. What is that? See, I don't know. But anyway, it's a wrap. It's genuine leather. Very pretty. That's what it looks like. We'll do that one for four.
We have some Shambhala type. What is it? Mm. Yeah, there's something in there. Is that a Fitbit or something? That's what it looks like. Yeah. Yeah, there's something in there. But it's not charged up. No, you couldn't see it either. Yeah. No, you couldn't see it. So we're selling it as is before. Cool. And we have these Shambhala type bracelets here. We have one and two. And this one is Love. Love This Life. Shell chips. And this one. With the elephant and moon and bicycle and cat's eye beads. Cute little charms. We'll do the three of those for five dollars. I'm not sure what this is. It's a freebie if anybody wants it. Make a difference. Again, a bracelet that you can adjust like that. We'll do that one for a dollar. Anklet puka shells and um, cat's eye beads, two dollars. We have these two bracelets. One is a brass and one's a copper look. Very pretty. They're magnetic, so they come out like that. This one too, right there. We'll do those for four dollars. Very pretty. Mixed metal. We have these three. We have a bangle. This one's very ornate. It's got like a leaf design. You can't see it. There we go. That one, and then we have this one, and this one. The uh, this looks like gunmetal. Gunmetal and brass is what it looks like we have here. We'll do those for two dollars. We have some wood beaded bracelet, and I don't know what is if this is stone. Feels like it's stone here. We have these bracelets. Three bracelets. We'll do those for two dollars. This one looks like another hair thingy. It is. There's the hair again. <laughs> oh, I'm going to have to clean that off. But anyway, it's uh, it's going somewhere else. Maybe in a trash can. Or I might cut the pearls off. I don't know. Okay. We have these Survivor bracelets. And this is a Charleston and pink. And this, and America, 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 I'm missing the A. Um, we'll do those for a dollar, the whole bunch. It's hobby like type stuff. Okay, we had this pendant, and I joined it with this cord necklace. 
It's a very thin cord, very soft. It's got, uh, I believe, sterling findings on it. Let's see. Yeah, 925. Italy 925. Very beautiful leather. Goes perfect with this glass pendant. Very pretty together. Let me show it to you on Little Sky. Beautiful autumn colors. We'll do this one for 10. It's gorgeous. Is that doing out? Just put it with the wooden. Then last of all, we've got this. Not last, but before we get into the earrings. This is a headband. Very pretty. It's got little rhinestones here. Rhinestone in there. Rhinestone in there. Faux pearl. More rhinestone and faux pearl. Gold tone. We'll do this one for $4.00. That's four, honey. And we're going to do the earrings now. Whoops. How much is that that headband was? Four. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. We've got tassel earrings. These are post tassel earrings. The other are French wire. We'll do those for a dollar. Here's that. And here's these. We have some large bamboo hoop earrings. Very cool. Very boho. We'll do those for two. Have some leather earrings. And they're marked uh, RLR. Lauren, Ralph Lauren. We'll do those for three. little shell earrings. They look like they may have some uh, can't tell if that's cold or not. Some kind of crystal or glass with it. There we go. That's the color. Here's the other one. Look like they may be marked too. Look. Yeah, these are marked 925. These are silver. Silver wires. We'll do those for five. I got the bag already done. Thank you. You're welcome, darling. I love these. Very pretty. Aurora Borealis Beauties. Oh, well, I did love them. That one's got a ding or something. It's the coating or it's dinged. I'm not sure. We'll do those for a dollar. They're gorgeous. Anyway, I'd wear them.
Next we have these little pearl, graduating pearl earrings in gold tone setting. Let's see. Here's the back. It's in great shape, both of them. We'll do these for three. Very nice. We have some little love knots, silver and a peachy orange color. Here's the backs. We'll do those for a dollar. We have these gunmetal, faux pearl, rhinestone, and bead. We'll do those for a dollar. Oh, these are lovely. I don't want to sell them. These are stone. The stone is, um, oh, why can't I think of it? Lap, not lapis, lapis. Lapis, beautiful lapis, if it will just focus. Lapis earrings. We'll do those for five. That's a deal. Still of a deal. Too bad I don't have ten pairs of ears. The next are some beautiful hoops, J hoops, and they are enameled. I can get them on my hand here. And the beautiful cream, gray, and gold. Here they are from side view. And underneath. And underneath. We'll do those for three. We have... Some little post earrings. With some stone and crystal, I believe. I'm not sure what that is. That might be enamel, but this looks like a little stone here. Got a brassy color. We'll do these for two. Jellyfish. <laughs> Here's our jellyfish earrings. Love that. Pink beads. We'll do these for three. These are gorgeous beaded earrings. Very native looking. Beautiful designed colors are just mm, Indian summer. Just love these. Uh, we'll do these for eight. Gorgeous. We've got some little stamped out metal earrings. And a dark um, silver color. We'll do those for a dollar. Have some pretty hoops, small hoops with little colorful dangled beads. We'll do those for a dollar. Yeah. Have some 
pretty wired. Looks to me like a uh, eclipse. Here's the back. These are very pretty, very pretty black earrings. We'll do those for two. They're in excellent condition. These are very pretty. Here's the backs. Show them first because that's very pretty the way the backs are. And here's the fronts. Fronts. The front. These are acrylic. I guess they're acrylic. Very pretty. Uh, we will do these for three. Well made. These are definitely acrylic, beautiful red earrings. Love those. We'll do those for two. Have these druzy like earrings, faux druzy. Here's the back. Do those for a dollar. I'll put these little backs on them. Okay. And going to be it. Well, thank you guys for watching our videos. Thank you for joining us. We enjoyed it. If anybody wants this for free, they can have it. If nobody claims it, then I'll just harvest the pearls off of them. Put them in the bead lot of building. Just throw it in there, honey. And uh, thank you for watching. If you enjoy these kind of videos, please give us a thumbs up. Hit that notification bell and uh, submit, subscribe, and you'll know when we put the videos up. And make your comments for the things that you want. Have a beautiful day, and we'll see you in the next either jewelry jar or box opening. Bye now. Bye-bye.